This is just what loads when you open Superior. It's not that it sounds bad, it's just not totally tweaked and not totally appropriate for the genre of music. Now there's, in my opinion, a big elephant in the room as far as the first thing that I would change about this right off the bat would be the kick drum. Uh, I think that kick, drum and, kick drums and metal should be more attacky and more punchy. Now I could definitely EQ that, but it's not quite exactly the sound I want. So I know right off the bat, I don't want this, and I even know what I'm gonna do. So right here on this drop-down menu, go to None, and then go to X Drum, hit New. Whoa, what do you know, it's gone. And then, remember how I said use generic picture? Use generic picture. Kick is the instrument I'm affecting. Right here I'm choosing where I want to bring the kick drum in from. And let's see, what options do we have? I'm gonna go with Metal Machine. But it's not mapped yet. So, right here. Actually, I'll do this in the mapping page. See how I grabbed this articulation earlier? Put it there. One thing I forgot to do. You have to set a microphone. So this is a misunderstood part of the process. You see right here it says microphone assignment. Just like a real drum set, you need to mic it up. There's no way around that. So here are your available microphones for that. What I did was I took kick drum right, which was up here, and moved it to new, and then it created this blue guy. This blue guy is going to come up on the mixer. now. This is a uh, two kick drum drum set. So we have a kick drum left as well. Going down to new, that's gonna come up on the mixer. You see these two blue guys? X1, kick drum right, X1, kick drum left. Do you guys understand what I just did? Right here we have the available microphones. You know, I could mic the kick drum with the hi-hat mic, but that's probably not a good idea. Um, I mic'd it with a kick drum mic. Cool. A mixer, you see X1. It's not totally done yet. That sounds like what I want. I think I'm gonna put that on C1 and replace. The reason I hit replace is because I didn't even want the old one that was there. I just want the new one. Now it's really quiet. Now you can see in the mixer that it's coming out.
That sounds 100% more like a metal kick drum.